You can call it a preseason tune-up. Dahlia Mountain Park in Durango is being groomed to get rid of some of the ex excess fuel that helps feed the wildfires. It's a project that started after the devastating Missionary Ridge fire in 2002 that burned nearly 70,000 acres in and around Durango. News 13's Amanda Goodman was on the mountain today as crews chipped and sawed away. We're removing some of this smaller diameter ponderosa pine as it serves as ladder fuels for the flames to jump from the ground up into the canopy of these larger, more mature ponderosa pine. When it comes to preventing the spread of wildfires, spring cleaning takes on a whole new meaning at Dahlia Mountain Park in Durango. <laughs> What's happening here is sort of a two-for-one situation. You see, the city of Durango has partnered with the Southwest Conservation Corps to allow them to train at the park. For us, it ends up being a really ideal training site for our forestry crews who will then go all over the Southwest to implement these kind of projects. In return, the crews do a lot of the fuel reduction in the park for the city. Everything from cutting down smaller trees to sawing off low branches. This is just part of a larger effort to get rid of excess fuel in city, state, and federal parks. It was started in 2003 after the Missionary Ridge fire. It burned about uh, 70,000 acres, cost about uh, initially uh, estimated at 40 million dollars. The city pays for the project through state and federal grants. Ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure and so that's what we're trying to do here is instead of waiting till something happens try to be ready for when it happens. We had a fire over in the Durango Mountain Park which is now called over in Mountain Park uh, two years ago and because of the fuels reduction efforts that we had done it did not spread as much as it would have had we not done that treatment. In Durango, Amanda Goodman, KRQE News 13. The Colorado State Forest Service says its fire season usually starts in June and lasts until the monsoons, but already this year it has seen a few fires spring up.